Let me ask y'all a question and be honest. Back when Telvin Smith retired or said he was taking a year off, whatever the fuck he said, and now he basically retired, and when I said, yo, something gotta be fucked up with his head, I hope he gets right. But no, everybody wanted to say, Oh, it's because he plays for the Jaguars. It's because no one wants to play for them. It's because he plays for the Jaguars. He's not mentally fucked. How fucking dumb do you feel now? Answer me that. How fucking dumb do you feel now? Now, admittedly, though, I knew he was fucked in the head, like, especially when he got popped for the DEA raiding his house for a bunch of weed. But, Jesus fucking Christ. I never could have imagined that it was this bad. Like, when I seen pictures come up of, like, the DEA surrounding his house, FBI about to surround his house or whatever, I thought, oh shit, here he go again, he got weed. But this dude is, this dude just got popped for lewd sexual acts with minors. So basically, let me, let, let me paint the picture for you and basically what this says. This dude took a year off of football to fuck kids. Are you fucking kidding me right now? Like, I'm not even gonna yell. I'm not even gonna yell because I'm just that disgusted. Like, I'm sick right now. Like, I, I'm ill. I want to throw up. This is. <sighs> and like, the thing is, like, this was one of my favorite players. This was a guy who, like, I loved and was a huge fan of. I got his fucking, jer I got his fucking jersey. And then this. Like, I've met this dude in person. Like, what the f I, I can't even put into words how I feel. Like, I'm that disgusted. Like, this is horrible. I'm going to tell you all like this. I'm not one that believes in this jersey burning bullshit. I mean, fuck, I got Jalen. I had Jalen Ramsey and Justin Blackman's jersey. The Justin Blackman jersey still downstairs. And the Jalen Ramsey jersey, like, I sold that shit. But one thing, but one thing I can say is I would never, like, I swore I would never burn nobody's jersey. But, like. Because they already got your fucking money, so what does it matter? But the thing with this, but the thing with this is, as much as y'all know of me being a Jags fan, I'm many, I'm a few things before that, and one thing's a father. Like, and how I would feel if somebody did this to my child. Like, this is fucking disgusting. Like, I hate. Like, I, I can't. Like. It's on a whole nother level from you doing drugs or being an asshole. This is... This is sickening, bro. Like, this is horrible. So... You know, yeah, they got my money for, t for buying this goddamn jersey that I bought back in 2016, I believe I bought it in. And I got three years, at, and I got three years out of it. They may got my money, but you know what? I refuse to have anything of a goddamn pedophile in my house. And I don't even want to sell it because it ain't even about money. So, this motherfucker in my fire pit is getting torched. Telvin Smith, I hope you burn in hell just like this jer just like this goddamn jersey about to burn. I can't even believe you. I just like this was in your soul before.
the fucking lighter is going to be shit. It's getting close. Like I said, I normally don't condone this shit, but when your players go R when your players go R Kelly, it's a whole different ball game. Burning hell, motherfucker. I swore I would never have to do I swore I thought I would never have to do this shit. Unfucking believable. Ugh, black smoke. On anybody saying, I hope he gets help. Nah, fuck that. Um, no. Not that. Not not for this. Not for this. Call me a fake fan all you all you want. I'm not having no pedophile shit in my house. And not that any of these players give a fuck, but. If you don't say no to pedo, your ass is gonna be in here too. If I if I end up being duped enough to buy your damn jersey. Fucking disgusting. Piece of shit. Good old Florida State for you.